Hello, Diocese of the Rio Grande. This is an emergency wildfire video in response to the South Fork Fire, which is currently raging in the mountain range around Rio Doso, New Mexico, Rio Doso Downs, Alto, New Mexico, and right in and around the Mescalero Apache Nation, which is located right there in those beautiful mountains. I wanna share with you some images that were taken by residents of Lincoln County who have close connections to the diocese. These were sent to me directly. These are private uh, person's photos that were taken over the last couple of days. And I want you to see just, just the magnitude of this fire and how frightening these things are. The fire is extremely hot and extremely terrifying. It is not yet under control. Those in Rio Doso and Rio Doso Downs have evacuated and they've been recommended to go down into Roswell but there aren't enough hotels, so some folks are moving into Artesia and even Carlsbad uh, to try to find a place to stay. If you are in Alto, they have been evacuated down the other side of the mountains, um, down Carrizozo Way, and we have some Episcopalians that are staying in the Almogordo area, having been evacuated from their homes. So today I'm asking for your prayers for the Mescalero Apache people, uh, who's Nation is right there in the Rio Doso area for all the people who are living in Rio Doso, Rio Doso Downs, and Alto, for all those that are fighting the fires as we speak, our prayers are with them. I also want to let you know that our diocesan relief effort has been coordinated by the Reverend Canon J.P. Arosa. J.P. was uh, in a meeting just last week talking with Episcopal Relief and Development about wildfire season and getting prepared for an event such as this. Uh, as of this morning, he's been in contact multiple times with Episcopal Relief and Development in order to figure out how we might um, apply for an emergency grant in order to help meet the needs of those who are being displaced by the fires as we speak. St. Andrews in Roswell and the Reverend Susan Pickett are already on the ground in Roswell, connecting with the network of local congregations in order to figure out what the needs are there. And so we are uh, just in the very early stages. This fire uh, started sometime yesterday afternoon. Um, most people were evacuated last night and uh, we're still uh, working with trying to identify where people are and to make sure that everyone is safe. So today I'm asking for your prayers. I'm also asking if you would like to donate to help with wildfire relief in uh, the Rio Doso area, and in response to the South Fork fire, there is a button on our diocesan website. I'll give you the link right below where you can donate directly to our diocesan wildfire relief effort for this wildfire season. So please join me in praying for all of those who are impacted by the fires. The Lord be with you. Come Holy Spirit, in the midst of those who are losing their homes, those who have fled with their animals, with their families, those who are watching in horror as they see the fire advance. Send your Holy Spirit, your comforting spirit, to be with them and give them strength and courage to face the days ahead. We pray also for those who are fighting the fires that they might have the strength of your Holy Spirit as they seek to preserve life. We ask that you would send your rain, send us monsoon rain to help fight the fire. We also ask for the opportunity to help give and to contribute in order to be a part of the healing in response to this situation. Come Father, come Son, come Holy Spirit, bring your comforting presence to us this day and strengthen us in the days to come. Amen.